Francisco Goya painted for royalty. He worked through the most wonderful times and the most dreadful times. Through all of this, his best artwork was a gruesome masterpieces. These paintings are the 3rd and 2nd of May, 1808. Both measure to be 8 feet 9 inches by 11 feet 4 inches. They were finished in two months. The more popular piece, the 2nd of May, actually showed the victory in the moment. It was considered a more modern day piece of the times. It actually changed the style of Goya's artwork. The 3rd of May was considered a risky and unpleasing painting because it showed defeat. Goya was not supposed to paint this painting because of his loyalty to royalty. The reason he wasn't supposed to paint it was because of what the issue it would cause and the meaning behind it. The meaning behind these masterpieces was of a rebellion of hundreds of Spaniards. What had happened to the Spaniards was horrific. They were all taken and brutally murdered by the French. That was how the war between Spain and France began, which made these paintings come to be. They were made to prove a point on all the horrific things that had just happened. All the terrible things were because of the Emperor of France was taking over the, over regions. The, as this was happening, the king tried to escape to the south to South America, but he was stopped by angry people, and they made him help his son. The French military leader decided it was a good time to invite them both to France. That was when they rose up against the army. A couple days went by. Both leaders of Spain were imprisoned. imprisoned. Ferdinand was kept for six years before being able to to take the throne. Ferdinand died in on September 29th, 1833.